So today I am at the under construction Cumberland bunker and uh, I'll have more to say about that in future videos. I wanted to share with you today an adventure that I had a few weeks ago. I was on a business trip and I was uh, in Colorado Springs and my return flight home was supposed to go through Denver. I had a very short turnaround, short layover, which I was a little nervous about. Sure enough, I get to the Colorado Springs airport and they start announcing delays. And I've traveled enough, I knew how this was gonna play out. And so I started talking um, to somebody from the airline about, hey, are there other combinations of flights to get me from Colorado Springs to Huntsville? And then this uh, young man who was quite urgent uh, walked up and said, hey, excuse me, I'm sorry, but I really need to talk. And I moved over to the side and, and uh, the gentleman said that he and his wife were trying to get to London. They had a connecting flight in London. They were gonna miss it. So they were gonna drive to Denver and try to make their flight. Now Denver uh, Airport from Colorado Springs Airport, about uh, 90 minutes, give or take, a little more, depending on traffic. And so um, they said, yeah, you know, we'll give you your luggage back and you can drive. And uh, the airline uh, guy said, uh, he looked at the gentleman and said, you got room for one more. He's trying to make a connection in Denver. And the guy looked at me and glanced and said, sure, why not? So I wound up driving to Denver with total strangers, and it turned out that they were from Alabama, of all things. So here I am in Colorado and trying to make a flight in Denver, and I hitch a ride with total strangers who happened to be from Alabama. Turned out the gentleman was a uh, minister, and he did uh, the praise team and so forth for his church. We hit it off great. Uh, turned out they were gonna have to fly the next day anyway. They weren't gonna make their flight. Um, they dropped me off and um, I made my flight and uh, all, was, uh, all worked out. It's one of those uh, strange instances in life where you just kind of have to roll with the punches and go, go with what happens. I was really impressed with the couple uh, their ability to just go with the flow uh, really impressed me. And it got me to thinking about a Bible verse that I want to share. And uh, it's from Hebrews, the 13th chapter, verse 1. Keep on loving one another as brothers and sisters. Do not forget to show hospitality to strangers. For by so doing, some people have shown hospitality to angels without knowing it. So I'm not saying that I wound up, um, uh, you know, encountering angels, but uh, that verse and the meaning of it, be kind to strangers, uh, I think is a good advocation to all of us and for us to be able to kind of go with the flow and, and maybe trust people now and then. In this case, it worked out. I had a wonderful time. Uh, I don't even remember their names and they probably don't remember mine but it's an adventure that I'll never forget and thought I'd share it with you today. Hope you have a great day.